We're expecting a decision any day now if a Fulton County grand jury will hand down an indictment for former President Trump and the investigation into infer interference in the 2020 presidential election. Only on 11 Alive, we caught up with District Attorney Fonnie Willis as she prepares for a possible indictment. Our Chrissy Diaz, she joins us now live outside the Fulton County Courthouse with more with DA Fonnie Willis. Good morning, Christy. Good morning. We caught up with DA Willis at a back to school event she hosted over the weekend and handing out book bags was a moment of peace and joy as she wraps up a multi year investigation into that possible election interference. But it is the unhappy people that she is taking uh, note of this morning. Take a look at this behind me. You can see those new orange barriers that are up around the Fulton County Courthouse this morning, um, all part of upping security as possible charges loom for the former president. Now, D.A. Willis says she has made a commitment to the American people to make a decision on charges by September 1st, and she says she's going to hold too true to that commitment. This could be Trump's third indictment case of the year, and at a rally in Pennsylvania over the weekend, he talked about it and remained defiant. It's a great badge of honor because I'm being indicted for you. All they're doing is hoping for massive election interference. The work is accomplished. I mean, we've been working for two and a half years. We're ready to go. Now, in preparation for what may come down in the coming days and weeks, DA Willis has blocked off much of August so she and her team can work remotely from home and also asked that judges not schedule any in-person hearings or trials from August 7th through the 14th. Ariana. And Chris, Sue, we know there's a hearing happening that week. There is one, yes. On August 10th, a judge just scheduled it. Uh, Trump uh, filed a lawsuit against DA Willis and Fulton County Superior Court Judge Robert McBurney, hoping to disqualify Willis from prosecuting this case and hoping to quash her final report. The hearing for Trump's motion is August 10th. Ariana.